Hi guys, Anton Tinsky here, and I'll do a little quick tip on how to change a redo hotkey uh, in 3D code. The problem is here that by default it's Ctrl Y to redo an action in 3D code. So Ctrl Z to undo it, but to redo it by default is Ctrl Y, and Ctrl Y is obviously pretty. It's Y is quite far on the keyboard, and much more common combination is Ctrl Shift Z to for redoing operations. And it, there's no easy way that I know to change the Ctrl Y. So, but there is a hard way. And for the hard way, let's let's just reset the key, keys for now. Let's see, is it? I have an old file uh, saved with, my, with all my hotkeys, so I'll do a load hotkeys uh, test. So it'll load it up. So I opened that file, the test uh, hotkeys, and here you can see it's pretty big and list, which is really hard to make out what's going on. But but essentially every hotkey you have, it will be recorded here. Every new hotkey will be recorded here as well. So and if you use the Control F command to find the redo if, you know, uh, let's go up by next you can see here right so the whole line command for the hotkey starts from one hotkey and goes to the end of the you no know, one hotkey one hotkey slash one hotkey this is your line that you can modify and it's pretty easy to read after you get accustomed to that so it says the code is for your keystroke uh, for Y. So you press Ctrl Y to do the redo. So we wanna. Uh, so we'll skip that for now. Then you have the Alt, which is false. Uh, shift is false. So it's either true or false. The binary action. So what do we wanna change here? You just wanna change it to Z. Uh, Ctrl still st still stays true, and we want to change the Shift false to true. Then you save this file, and well, let's load it again, reload, and let's do a couple cuts and undo and redo. So I'm just pressing my Control Z, Control Shift Z, and it's all working out fine. This is also a technique that works quite well for different hotkeys. It doesn't always behave that great for like I was trying to change some hotkeys here, and sometimes it starts to bug bug out and but yeah, for something simpler like a redo, this is a great way to, to do it. And I really recommend you guys to switch from Ctrl Y to Ctrl Shift Z. It's a much better, much faster workflow. Thank you.